I've got I've got a seven kilowatt PV system, twenty kilowatt hour battery. I'm about eight hundred bucks in credit. Yeah, yep. much people get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seventy five percent of our customers over the course of a year will have at least one bill that's in credit. And don't forget that a lot of our customers don't have battery and don't have solar. So, how does the normal energy retailer model works? Yeah. Okay. So so typically, some of our other friends who run VPPs would maybe offer something like say two hundred dollars a year for two hundred kilowatt hours from your battery. Sounds great. But I guess two things there. One, our customers could easily make two hundred bucks from their ten kilowatt hour battery in a day or two with a couple of price spikes. Mm. And two, most of our friends who are running those other VPPs don't give you any say in terms of when they're going to take that power out of your battery or take that energy out of your battery. They're just like, there's a price spike, we're going to take it, thank you very much. You have no say in it, no control. But is that made clear in the sales pitch? I don't know. Maybe maybe not as clear. As you say, a lot of, a lot of people have a, a, a high degree of mistrust of the big guys. Mm. Their net promoter scores are not usually that high because, mm. Mm. yeah, they've been taking money from our pockets for years and years, and that's why lots of people have solar and people are putting in batteries because they want to escape from those guys. And then, ironically, some of them end up going back to them because they have these VPPs that, again, don't give them the value that they deserve from their asset and from their investment.